Hello, 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 and welcome to Space Digger. I'm Evie Greenbottle, and today we're going to be checking out this roguelike game. I was lucky enough to be given a key for it from QBs, so thank you so much for the developers for sending a key to me. That is really kind of them. Uh, we're going to be checking it out. Now, this game is still in development, so we may find a few quirks a few kinks along the way and if we do that's okay the developers have been really really on top of things i played this game on stream once already and they've already let me know that some of the things that i had discovered while playing out on stream have been addressed so it's quite amazing how on top of it they are so let's jump right in we're gonna start on the ice planet because why not in this game we're going to be destroying a bit of a planet we're going to be taking the resources away from the poor little robotic aliens that are here uh, and they're going to try to fight us off and we're not going to let them as best we can <laughs> and our goal is to get 100% of the planet mined now I have played this game a few times and I've only managed to get to 100% once it's not super easy take a lot of damage right we can go damage reduction or we can go minor nanobots let's try that one now that looks like something that's already been fixed because when i played this before the minor nanobots didn't work you clicked on it and then nothing happened but now it looks like it's been fixed so let's send them out and see what they can do there they are there's our little minor nanobots and they've come and they've destroyed this for us right away that's really handy so they're going to be very very helpful stop shooting at me right we've already taken a significant amount of damage so probably need to be a little bit more careful we definitely need to be picking up our points here Ooh, rotate around this is my favorite skill it's just so good for destroying things but also for mining nice all right we're getting some bigger enemies here let's avoid them Ooh, gathering zone increases or an active skill sonic blast I think we have to go with the sonic blast <laughs> though we haven't actually gathered any passive skills yet it's good to be able to make sure we can stay safe because we are down already to 79 hit points not ideal oh stuck man they do work on those things don't they <laughs> it's very good Ooh, we could upgrade our minor nanobots or we could get a grenade launcher let's go upgrading our nanobots because i'd really like some passive skills if we could <laughs> uh-oh uh-oh, <laughs> slightly surrounded here. And that guy's really fast and he's hot on our heels. Right, we've taken kind of significant damage. We're down to less than half health. And the thing that I always forget about this game is that you can go into a shop in here and we can actually buy some upgrades. So we could buy some boosts, which would give us different benefits. The health one is very good, but we also probably need to get our max health increased, our movement speed and the saw blade upgrade. Now we've got a bit of money, so let's get the saw blade upgrade. Let's get a max health upgrade and then let's just buy ourselves 20% instant health regen. Now it has a cooldown, but we will be able to buy that again. Well, they didn't quite do enough damage on that one. It was much harder. Right, we can be able to deal critical damage or we can get Sonic Blast level two. Let's go critical damage. Critical damage seems like it would be a good idea. That would help. We haven't quite done very much damage on that one. Let's come over here. Let's see what we can do to this big one. All right, we could get a grenade launcher or Sonic Blast level two. Now, if we get the grenade launcher, that's going to be the last of our active skills that we're going to be able to get. It's not a terrible idea, but Sonic Blast being level two would also be kind of helpful. Let's go with that for now. I want to see kind of what other active skills we're able to uh, to get. And that Sonic Blast level two is definitely going to be helping. Oh my goodness, it's getting a wee bit hairy. We've got some bigger enemies here. We might need to head into the shop and buy another health upgrade. But also, maybe we'll get the movement speed upgrade as well. That could only help, right? And when you know, the going gets tough, the tough get going. Ooh, let's grab that and just pick up anything that we may have missed send our nanobots over there well we'll come over to this one all right they're coming but if we just do one of those that's going to help a bit they're still on their way though oh my goodness they're all firing at us can we get through this we did oh we could really use another uh oh my goodness some other sort of move that's going to help them dig damage here oh there we go gathering zone increase or the machine gun Machine gun is okay. We can go with the machine gun. It'll take out a couple of them. Oh boy. Uh oh, that didn't. Our dash didn't do anything. I dashed in a very bad spot. We are getting kind of low on health, so we do need to watch that. Oh no, the health. The health is going way down. Damage reduction or more vision. We better go damage reduction. We better also run. Ah, uh, no, no, no. Oh, didn't get that quite in time. Oh, that was a very silly, silly move of me. <laughs> oh, right. All right, that didn't go particularly well. Let's try again on Mars this time and let's uh, pay better attention to our health. That would be a good idea. <laughs> uh, I just remember need to remember to use the shop. I often just, I don't know, I just don't don't use it. It's right there. It's not so hard. Have access to it anytime you want. <laughs> now we're on Mars. So all of the Martians are after us. 
And I like how they are like different than in the other level. Okay, the drop mine. So it will randomly just drop mines. It's a passive skill, so we don't actually partake in that. It'll just randomly allay mines or a circuit magnetic field, which does continuous damage per second to people around us. Let's go with the drop mine. I actually quite like that one. There we go. So there's a mine that's just popped out. Let's see if we can lead the enemies into it. No, nope, they're just going to go around it. Well, do you know what? It's there for later. <laughs> there's another one. Let's see if we can get them into it this time. Hit the mine. <laughs> there we go. At least some of them hit it. Ooh, blade storm. Hmm. Or damage reduction. Let's go with damage reduction. If we're taking less incoming damage, that could be... That's only beneficial, right? Right. I think all, this is already going slightly better than it did last time. We've got maybe less of the map destroyed, but we've only taken six, six points of damage, so that's something. Ooh, health regen or movement speed boost. Oh, I kind of want both. Let's go with health regen, though. Well... A health, health will do that. <laughs> Get our health back up to 100 by finding some health inside of a rock. A bit of coin. Oh, we did take a point of damage there. I really need some active skills. <laughs> We've only had like, I guess we had one chance to get an active skill, but it's not the active skill that I want, so. Whoa, okay. Ooh, rotate round. That's my favorite one, so let's definitely have that. It's great for killing enemies, but it's also great for mining rocks. Oh, it's so strong. I mean, you have to put yourself a little ways into harm, harm's way, but that's okay. There's no reward without a bit of risk, right? Pretty sure that's the rule. All right, critical damage allows to deal critical damage or a movement speed boost. Ooh, tricky. Uh, I think let's go with the critical damage. Movement speed boost, obviously that would be quite good, but we can always just dash away. So I guess that's what the hope is there. All right, we can upgrade our health regen to level two, which honestly feels pretty good, or sonic blast, which would give us another active skill. But I think health regen level two, will be good. Let's try to keep our health as high as we can because I want to get to 100% of this map completed. And we're only at 24% at the moment. So a little bit of health regen is going to go a long way. I don't feel like they're stacking up like they usually do. Uh oh, but there are getting a lot of bots. We're getting overwhelmed here. Completely surrounded. <laughs> okay, let's get in there. Oh, good. Okay. Health regen to level three or critical damage to level two. Let's go critical damage. We're in the middle of a massive battle here. Oh, get rid of that guy. He's so scary. Oh, no, that's not working. Ah, run away. Wait, we took so much damage there. Oh my goodness. Okay, health regen. Oh, we didn't upgrade any of these things yet. This is what I always forget. Let's upgrade them each once and then let's get our saw blade upgraded a bit more and then we'll hold on to our extra 500 for getting more health regens later. Because we only have 37 health, so we do need to kind of play the runaway game here. But... At least we have health regen level two, so that's going to be ticking up. Oh my goodness, stay away from me. <laughs> we really need some more passive skills, or active skills rather. I guess the nanobots, I mean, at least they will help destroy a bit more of the map. You guys can go deal with that one. I'm going to go over to this one. Uh-oh. We are very low health. Maybe, is this up again? Nope, we can't do that quite yet. There is a cooldown on it, so you can't just continuously buy health. Let's leap them to that bomb. Good. Oh my goodness, they're all coming. I need more active skills. <laughs> okay, we can buy a bit more health. So we'll do that. We're up to 61 now. That's something. There's so many of them, though. We take out all of these guys without losing all of our health. Run away. Run away. We're almost leveled up, though. If we can go back and collect some of the coins from or points from things we may have already killed, then that would be very helpful. Leveling up would be super helpful. Oh, especially since we're down to 18 hit points. Right, I need a few more of those. <laughs> yes, those mines to drop out. Oh, they that guy was too far in the front. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we're being overwhelmed. Oh, those guys with the shields. Okay, run them through that. Oh, that did very little, if any, damage. <gasps> oh, man. We need some ranged attacks. I really need to level up. We're not that far away, but the problem is we're so low health. Let's see if we can upgrade. Buy a bit of health and let's upgrade our movement speed, I guess. It's going to help us just play the runaway game. Oh, there we go. Let's go Sonic Blast. And hopefully we can do a bit of that there. So everyone's kind of down to half health there, which is good. If we can do that again, or if we could drop like a grenade behind us, a mine rather, not a grenade, a mine. Come on, drop a mine. <laughs> What's up? Ooh, got quite a few of them, but... Oh, that thing did so much damage! <laughs> oh, no! We only got to 34% too. That's that's not very good. Now, one time I did get to 100%. On stream, I managed to do that, but not, not when recording. Of course not. But it did look like... Yeah, we got up to level 8 totally. So Zark Zappleton, he is leveled up. <laughs> 
Oh boy. All right, I think we can do better. Let's try one better. Well, actually, Ice Planet. I like the blue. I'm not a big fan of the color red, so blue is more my style. Ice Planet over Mars any day. All right, let's try to do better this time. I think the difficulty last time was we didn't have any active skills. If you don't have any active skills, then uh, there's very little you can do. I mean, you need some ranged attacks. Okay, these guys are shooting and they shoot from quite the distance. Stop that. Ah, and there's so many of them. Stop this. Uh, magnetic area that gives us at least an active. Whoop, that did quite a bit of damage. And we've already leveled up again, so we can get health regen now or magnetic area level two. Let's go with health regen. I think it's gonna be so helpful to be actually getting the regen. Oh good, we could definitely have used that health. That's great. Back up to 100%. Nice, can't complain about that. Stop following me, sir. He <laughs> does like some sort of dash and he just slides along on the ice. Let's wait for them to get a bit closer and then we'll use our magnetic area. Ooh, that's doing a lot of damage to them. Let's go for critical damage. Now, nice that they're robots, so magnets do mess with their computer systems, obviously. Now, there was a health on the ground back there, but I'm going to just leave it because I don't need it at the moment. And then hopefully we'll find it again later on when we do really need it. Ooh, there we go. Cooldown reduction. Okay, so that means we'd be able to use our active skills more often, which could be really good. Or Sonic Blast. I mean, I do like that one, but maybe cooldown reduction is good. That's like, you know, investing in our future, I feel. Being able to use all of our abilities more often. We have taken a bit of damage here. Our active is not quite ready. Come on, magnetic area. There we go. That's what we need. Oh, minor nanobots. We'll go with those again. Uh, magnetic area, we could do level two or health regen, we could do level two. Let's go with the health regen. Oh, and we found some health on the ground as well, which is good. And we have a thousand, so let's go to the shop really quick and get a saw blade upgrade and a max health upgrade. Cleared some of those guys out, that's good. Uh, but they just keep coming. They just keep coming. We need more active skills. We need to level up. Ooh, there we go. Let's get the grenade launcher. I quite like it. A grenade launcher, when you have a big pile of them chasing you, it's really, really quite strong. Like that. Bam. Take that. Guys, go get that for me. Whoa. Ah, overwhelmed. Ah, the bigger guys. Throw a bomb at them. Ow. Ow. Oh, there's a bit of health that those guys managed to get, which is good. We'll have to go back for that. Let's see. If you guys get too close, we'll just do this. Ooh, okay. We can upgrade our grenade launcher. Let's definitely do that. Oh my goodness, but let's get away from this area. It's very dangerous. Get our blade spinning again. And yeah, I think we will pick that up. It's given us a big bit of health there. Oh my goodness, stop that, stop that. <laughs> ah, ah, there's too many, <laughs> there's too many. Ooh, okay, I think let's go with more critical damage. Now, if there's one thing that I'd like to see added to this game, it would be stats for your different abilities. So when you click on your abilities, when, you have, when you're looking to see which one you wanted to choose, there's no, currently there's no stats on them, so you don't really know what you're getting. I'd like to see like, how long is the cooldown reduction on it? So like, how long is it gonna take before I can use it again? What is the like, you know, damage per second on things? Or, you know, just small things like, I want some stats, I am stat driven. Even if it was just like, I don't know, Vague percentages, I think I'd be all right with that. And that, and I suppose that the ability to customize my character. I'd like to see that added as well. Not that this weird space ogre is not, you know, cool, but I don't know. I'd like to be able to play as a girl. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Avoid that fire for sure. Let's just do that to him. My goodness, okay. Yep. <laughs> we'll do the cooldown reduction. Let's just magnetic field them. Take some damage with your magnets. Ah, we're stuck. We're stuck. Ah, they're coming. There's too many. Ooh, there we go. Drop mines. I do like the drop mines because it means behind us, we can just sort of outrun things. Okay, we have a little bit of money. It might be time to do some sort of upgrade. Let's just check. We could do a health up. No, let's do the saw blade upgrade, I think. We've got just a little bit of money left. We don't need any health at the moment. Ooh, let's go level three health regen. Although level three cooldown reduction would have also been quite good. Ah, run away. Uh oh, very bad. Taking a lot of fire. Ah, whoa, it was massive. All right, let's level up our nanobots. Ah, those things are so big. Such heavy fire. <laughs> no. <laughs> now, I can't work out what those orbs do because I thought they'd be your experience points, but you seem to get the experience points immediately whether you collect those things or not. So, whoa, whoa, that's a lot. It is not doing that much damage to them. Run away. <laughs> Although we didn't take too much damage there either. Ooh, there we go. Let's level up the miner nanobots. Oh my goodness. We need one more active skill. 
Oh, a magnet. That's good. But see, the magnet should collect all of those orbs, and it does. But then, what does that get you? I'm not sure. The passive drop mine is so good. Don't need that health. Gotta be money, maybe. Maybe those picking up those orbs just gives you money. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's what I'm missing this whole time. Okay, we do have a bit of money. It would be worth maybe going into the shop because we could upgrade our movement speed and our saw blade. I think the better our saw blade is, the faster we're going to get through all of these things, which is kind of the goal, so. Oh my goodness. Okay, uh, oh, rotate round. Yes, it's kind of the last one that we wanted there. It's good for clearing out larger groups of them, but it's also good for clearing these things out, so. Right, we're at 52%, so that's, <laughs> this is going better. Ah, oh, this guy is persistent. <laughs> okay, let's try to get rid of some of these guys. That missed, that was not great. Okay, we took some very heavy fire there. Really, I think what we want is to get one of these to land on that big group, but it's not, it keeps missing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> right, let's go to the store and just get this. And there's nothing else we can afford at the moment. But the, yeah, get our health back up. Keep our health as high as we can keep it. Oh, it's never going to the big group of them. Ah, ah we're taking so much fire. Run, run away. Uh, rotate round level two. Yes, please throw that out kind of getting trapped in this corner <laughs> super not ideal ah but no this is a bad idea right let's head into the shop we've got a bit of money again we're gonna need to buy a bit of health <laughs> and then let's get a max health upgrade and the movement speed upgrade i think are good choices we'd love another oh yeah those orbs are definitely the money that is definitely how we get money so we need to get those so we can afford a bit more stuff so you get experience immediately upon killing them. We're at 69% of mines destroyed. So that's going quite well, I suppose. Let's go, oh, drop mine level two. I'm happy to have that. Danger, danger, <laughs> run away. Oh no. Oh my goodness, what is that thing? Ah, it's like shoot, it's massive. It's like shooting rockets at us. Ah. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh my, our bomb doesn't even do very much damage to it. Okay, we are at 75% destroyed though, so we are getting somewhere. Or at least making some progress this time, unlike the last two times. Oh, here's a mine that just dropped. I wonder if we can get a lot of guys into it. That would be ideal. Or just the big guy will take that too. Ooh. Oh, I did not need to get that health. That was a waste. Okay, we still have like nearly full health. So that's at least something. Oh my gosh. But what is happening here? Oh, and that bomb missed like everybody. Oh, we got a magnet. That's good. So that gives us a bit more money. Oh, that gave us more health. Not that we needed it, but we'll take it. Ooh, okay. Health regen level four. We'll take that. Oh my goodness. Right, our health is dropping. Our health is dropping. Flee, flee. All right. I would love another level up. Oh my, that is some heavy fire. <laughs> Don't do it. Okay, good. Mine is good. Does not do enough damage to him. Oh my goodness. All of those things just do so much damage. We're at 82% of the way cleared though, so I'm feeling pretty good. And we're full health. So not much more we could ask for there. Oh my goodness. Okay. Here's a mine we can run some guys into. They just blew up nothing. Interesting. I mean, we could try to get them to run into that mine. They are coming. <laughs> well, we could see, right? If I send these guys off, right? I don't know how much that helped. All right, they went over there. Let's get in there. Right, drop that. It's only good to get that one guy. Classic. Right, we're at 87%. Oh, it's getting close. Not that much more left. Let's just get in there. Good. The nanobots are great. So last time I played this, when I played this on stream, the nanobots didn't work. So you could like click on it and then you would never actually get it added to your um, abilities. But yeah, the developers have been really, really quick to fix things and it's been really great. This game is available on Steam as a demo, so if you are finding it as fun as I am, you should definitely check it out. It's quite addicting, so be prepared to uh, to spend your weekend <laughs> playing. Right, let's get them into that. There's a bind there. Okay, didn't get as many of them as I'd hoped, but let's get that dropped over on them. That will help. Oh, it's, it's, we're just not doing as much damage anymore. They seem to have uh, picked up the pace a bit, I think, on their their health. Ooh, we need to upgrade. Let's go to the shop quickly. Uh, upgrade our saw blades, and that's all we can afford at the moment. Oh, we're so close, okay. Run, flee with extra flee. Oh my goodness, they are coming for us. Okay, we're just gonna do a bit of this action. 
Come over here. Send that off. Send those guys off. Oh my goodness. Okay. Grenade launcher level three or rotate around. Let's go rotate around level three. We're getting so close here. Right. We are at 96%. So we are nearly there. Just need to survive a tiny bit longer. But it's going very well. Oh, uh oh, this one doesn't want to go away. I think we got it there. No, we're still at 96%. That didn't do anything for some reason. Okay, got that one. Let's come over to these guys. Oh, it drops to the wrong side. Right, 98. We've got just a few more left here. Right, 99. If we can destroy one more, we should be... We should be... Yes, we did it! We won! We destroyed enough minerals! Ah! We killed 1,620 creatures. Oh, that's very good. All right, so... That is QB's Space Digger, and it is really fun. Now, the game is still in development, but if you're keen to play it, the demo is available on Steam, and I definitely suggest checking it out because it is very fun. There are even some upgrades that you're going to be able to do, and also you can do missions here. So we've been looking for three Peridot Minerals. Oh, we haven't found any of those yet. I think that's possibly in the unreleased world, the coming soon world. So I think this mission is kind of on hold until we can get that mission underway. I love this game. I think it has so much potential and I know that they're working really hard over at QBs to make sure it's top notch. And if you've enjoyed it as well, make sure to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any more Space Digger, but also many other things over on our channel. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye bye.